Look to the sky. It welcomes us all. There's there's nothing in the sky, bro. Hey guys, and welcome to my channel. And today, we are doing another episode of Strangerville. And so, um, Lacey has just been uh, sleeping away the night. She has been promoted to private fourth class. She has also, she has received a metal display case and a bravery heart. Oh. She got a bravery heart now. Oh, interesting. All right. Well, we're going to put this down here with the other metal we got, which is right here. It says we also got a display case. I'm guessing that's in our household inventory. Let's go take a quick look. Oops, wrong button. Oh, I wonder if I can actually put them in there. That'd be pretty cool. I cannot. Unless she can put them in there herself. Hold on. <gasps> you just have to be in live mode to do it. Okay. Okay. All right, so what is her work from home assignment today? Practice sparring. That is it. All right, so she's got to go to the bathroom, and she's going to take a shower real quick. We'll have her practice some sparring, and then she can get some leftovers from the fridge. And what else? So she is feeling cooped up, and she is hungry. So she, yeah, she's going to come down here. She's going to grab something to eat. And then guess what? The rest of the day is ours. So let's have her maybe work on that uh, programming skill again. Maybe make that mod for Blick Block and um, maybe hack the Llama Corn uh, Listserv and the Lothario Chest Fund. Why not? I mean, what if there was actually, like, punishments for doing that in the military career? Like, you got demoted or something. Like, that seems very, very interesting. That'd be very, that, that would add in, like, some realism for sure. Or maybe even, like, from poking around at the science lab, they find out it's you. And you end up getting demoted or whatever. Or fired. Alright, she's still making that mod for Blick Block. And what else can we have her do? Um, just practice some programming after that. She has reached a programming level four. She can make viruses, and she can also hack school grades, but she's not a teen, so it doesn't really matter. It's too hot. All right, let's see if there's a, let's see if we can add in the thermostat. We'll get the thermostat. I didn't really wish to do that, but... I mean, not that I hate the thermostat, because I don't. Um, I was also just trying to keep it more Stranger Village here, but that's okay. Um, I do have a mod, by the way, that gives me an automatic thermostat. In case you have missed my last mod review, it is in Little Miss Sam's Seasons mods, and it's freaking bomb. Because she can come down here, pay for the automatic thermostat. Essentially, you'll have central heating and air that is automatically controlled. You don't have to change it all the time. It automatically changes itself. So when it gets too cold, it turns the heater on. When it gets too hot, it turns the cooler on. Hey, she was able to make 60 bucks from the Llama Corn List Serve. So. And she is hacking the Lothario Trust Fund, and then she just needs to do some practicing of programming. But we seriously need to go back to the secret lab. So we can get more evidence. Or maybe we can invite over a couple of the scientists. I guess maybe we should have actually like asked them about their career. This way we knew what they actually did. Oh, she got 125 bucks from the Lothario Trust Fund, too. Can she put this in her inventory? No. 
I don't think so. No, I don't see it. Well, that's kind of lame. What was the point of having a laptop if you can't actually put it in your pocket and go? There we go. Paid for the automatic thermostat and... Should have the little... There it is. Refreshing air conditioning. How can you be tired? You didn't really do anything today. You sat on the computer. Well, go ahead and catch some Z's and then we'll have her uh, get some leftovers. Maybe we should get something like in this room for like her archaeology stuff. Because they're still sending her like all sorts of archaeology stuff to do. Archaeolo. Oh. Should be under activities and skills, though. Let's see. Recre. Oh, it was right there. What's it called? Oh, there's a second A. I'm dumb. There. So we'll be taking up one of these bedrooms for now as uh, her archaeology room. Go ahead and get the mail. She can get up. I know it's midnight, but she can get up. <laughs> she can get up, get some food, and then I will have her practice her archaeology skill. She's collected everything from the mailbox. Alright, authenticate this artifact. Can I tell her to authenticate a bunch at once? I don't think I can, because I think you have to like pull it off and then... Hmm. I guess we'll just have to find out. Aw, she didn't even watch the TV season premiere. This artifact is genuine. Mailbag artifact. Great, she's on the road to fame. As compensation for time and effort, Lacey spent on authenticating the Amazon Harvest Knife from the artifacts they've given her $3,852. And authenticate this one. Yeah, I don't think you need to bring the glass with you. Oh, just focusing? I think focus helps with programming. I'm pretty sure it does. So now that she's nice and good and focused, maybe we could go up there and have her do more programming. This artifact is genuine. Mail back. And they gave her $3,331. Authenticate this one. Oh, and she went for a dip in the pool. We're going to work from home. So she needs to go for a jog. Apparently she went for a jog. Oh, okay. Apparently she needs to go for another jog. That was a nice glitch. Beautiful glitch. I mean, it is true that she can't do the whole work hard thing from home. But, I mean, if you think about it, we get more time to do whatever it is that we want to do, you know? Uh, must be on her home lot. Oh, because she's out jogging right now. Whoa, whoa, hold on a second. Try to talk to Jess. This is the first sim I've seen that's been, like, in... I'm not sure if it's, like, infected is the right word. She's military personnel. Beautiful photo. Maybe get past her shoulder here. Oh, there we go. That's a beautiful thumbnail right there. <laughs> Apparently she's been blessed. <laughs> Look to the sky. It welcomes us all. There's, there's nothing in the sky, bro. Bro, we need to talk. That kind of creates a cool effect, though. Like, I can't lie. Oh, 
Oh, it's because she is blessed. That's the reason why everybody keeps getting blessed. Oh, she was just looking at the plant. She's talking to the plant. Hold on, I want to look at this. Wait, continue to talk to the plant. Okay, apparently she was, she was like, nope, I'm going to go back home and go back to bed. Pretend this was all just some horrible nightmare. Get leftovers. Why does she keep trying to make? Why does she keep making food? She has food. Um, and then mail back the artifact. Did she determine if that was fake or genuine? Oh, it's genuine. Oh, cool. You couldn't reach the mail. Are you sure? Are you sure? The mailbox is right there, bro. I don't think you just wanted to try. That reminds me, I ended up getting a couple of packages mailed to my house, and um, it said they were delivered, and I went out on my front porch, and they were not, in fact, delivered. So it leads me to believe that they put them in my mailbox, which I absolutely hate with a white-hot rage. A package was left at the parcel locker. Oh, okay. Well, at least it's locked up, I guess. There is that. Hopefully they recognize the fact that it was two of them and they put them in the same box. I got two books delivered to me, so. So she'll come down, get some food, and then we can have her authenticate this one. She's actually getting fame from that, from authenticating artifacts. Sounds very interesting. A lot of wind. And I don't just mean in my own hometown. Like, it's windy in The Sims. Oh, there's another one. Most people seem to still be walking normally, but. Oh, did you eat already? Oh, she did. Cool. Maybe this will make her focused again, and then we can go back to working on the programming skill. Mail it back. And she got three grand from that. And last one. That's the last one they mailed you. And she has ten pieces of evidence. She has two things of seed packets, though. I wonder if she can, like, go on her own computer and attempt to, like, find information, you know? Before you go anywhere, mail that back. And... Program. Oh, yeah, it does help. Go practice your programming. So that should at least help her programming skill go up much faster. And then she should be at level 5. So she can't decrypt the USB drive just yet, but... What can she do with the rest of it, though? She can't really do much, you know? Oh, cool. She's level five. Does she have to go to work tomorrow? She does not. All right, let's go ahead. Let's go to the lab then. Since she doesn't have to go to work tomorrow, let's go collect uh, the sample for the samples from the computers, and then maybe we'll go to like the library or something, and maybe get to know a couple more scientists. It's probably the land grab lab or something. 
hack for evidence, hack for evidence. <gasps> and there's new piles of evidence around. That's cool. I'm gonna have her go through everything all over again. This way we can kind of like open some of the seed packets, maybe complete, maybe keep the USB drive for ourselves. You know? Strange blueprints is what she found on the first computer. It's helping her programming. Yes, and it's helping her programming skill at the same time. She did not find anything useful on this computer. Maybe one of the others will have something. She found a hastily hand-scrawled note. Oh, that one's broke. Why is she breaking all the computers in order to find information? Like, that seems kind of rude. This computer seems to have some encryption. Requires heading a skill 9 or higher. Oh. Are we up to 15 yet? We're at 14, and she has two more computers to go through. Okay, go ahead and go to the bathroom, and then you can search for evidence, search for evidence. Search and hack. Woo, yeah, she was running on fumes there. But she made it, and that's what my... Oh, thought she made it. Use that one. Oh, she didn't make it. Okay, well, wash your hands a lot. That's how you get clean. You just become neurotic about washing your hands. Uh, search, search, and hack. At least no one was around to see her stumble on her. A clanzatine dongle? What the hell? How is that? That's the blueprints. Glitched hologram readout. Hand scrawled notes. What is this? Huh. Oh, yeah, I guess that doesn't really help. I mean, she's going to be able to get one anyway. Oh, she found more strange blueprints. And I think, yeah, there's this box and this computer still left. I think we got everything else again, though. That room's done. Oh, we didn't get that one. That's done, done. Did, is she just breaking? She's just literally breaking all the computers. I guess in order to hack into them, you gotta break them, I guess. That doesn't really make much sense to me, but... I guess so, at the same point, you know. She did not find anything useful on this computer. She just broke that one for nothing. And this will be the last one. Sweet. And she got another thing of seed packets. Oh, right. Um, let's go ahead and have her head home. Because then she can compile the dossier and get the key card for the front door. But I want to go ahead and have her open the seed packets when she gets home. I mean, it looks like we might be able to continue to make more dossiers, like, later down the road. You know? Alright, let's have her... Oh, that's not... This. Uh, open that. She got bizarre fruit. This bizarre fruit has an ominous glow to it, if it contain as if it contains some living spore. Well, let's plant these. How about we don't eat the bizarre fruit? This can be used to obtain... Aw, oh, man, they took our freaking USB drive. I was hoping they wouldn't do that. Water all and take picture. Oh, this is definitely a different plant. Isn't it? No. 
No, it's the same plant. Never mind, just kidding. So essentially we just planted more of those plants around our place. Beautiful, just what I suspected. Um, but we have enough to make a dossier, so we had we had one made. And so now we just have to get the key card to open the door. Uh, but she needs to kind of take inventory of herself first before we go out and just start getting the key card and exploring the lab and everything. So I'm going to go ahead and just take care of her needs. So go ahead and watch some TV. And then she can come upstairs and go to sleep. And then I'm thinking this is probably a really good time to let her go, let her uh, go do her stuff, and we can uh, pause the series right here. We're going to end this episode right now. So go ahead, give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it, which definitely helps out small channels like mine. Don't forget to subscribe if you did like it. This way you can catch more videos just like this one and all my mod reviews and my other stuffs that we got going on on the channel. Uh, definitely leave your feedback, comments, and suggestions all down below. And so have you made it into the secret lab? Don't leave any spoilers down below for anybody else, but have you made it in and were you surprised by what you found? I definitely want to know that. It's very, very interesting. Um, all my social media is in that description box in case you want to hit me up on Twitch, Twitter, or Facebook. And I do live streaming on Twitch three times a week on Mondays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. And those all start at 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. I would love to see you there. Uh, thank you for watching this video. Have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys! Thank <laughs> you.